Tonight, a couple of unlikely elves in a workshop right here in the tri-state are getting credit for creating a priceless gift. Uh, the best part, nine on your side's Julie O'Neill tells us these elves are teenagers who put countless hours into this project for a student they never even met before. Just walking down this hallway of Lloyd Memorial High School, Alyssa Roberts is honing skills that'll lead her not just to a job, but freedom. I've always worried about how, I, how am I going to be independent? How am I going to do this? How am I going to do that? And this is a really great place to start. This is a specially equipped walker that also gives Alyssa sight through sensors. Her physical therapist connected the group May We Help with some engineers willing to work on a solution for Alyssa. St. X robotic students Evan Brettel and Tyler Staggy. It uses six ultrasonic distance sensors to figure out the distances of objects away from the walker in front, kind of to the middle and on the sides. Then the computer sends signals to her headphones that give different beeps. In addition to that, uh, the, the handles are all custom built and uh, those have mounted to them infrared distance sensors which are angled down in order to detect drop-offs, uh, for example, you know, curbs or stairs. Even when the school's out, they let the boys come over and help us, you know, help her navigate the hallways when there's no students so that it's a safe environment for her to practice. It was kind of empowering to see how what we're doing with robotics can be applied so directly to help someone. Staggy and Brettel already have plans for improvements, something Alyssa says keeps her pushing forward. I think they're amazing because <laughs> Nobody else could figure it out, and they did, and they're in high school. So I just can't thank them enough. Julie O'Neill, nine on your side.